Okay, Baylor Y Television at the Act for Change launch, and with me I have actor, uh, writer, uh, filmmaker, occasional theatre director, um, equity union activist, yes. Mr. Daniel York. Hi. So, Daniel, tell us about your involvement with Act for Change, and obviously what's happened today at the launch. Well, based basically, uh, you know, I, 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 I'm the chair of the Equity Minority Members Committee, so I've brought in as an equity representative. Also, I've done a lot of campaigning for East Asian actors as well. Right. You know, and so I, you know, we, 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 I came to be involved through what Danny was doing after he saw that the right. ITV trailer, and we all thought, you know, it's time to do something, and and you know, get as many people involved as possible. And it's just kind of snowballed incredibly quickly. It's just been astonishing, really. You know. Cool. So, what, what were your thoughts about how today was? Did, did you feel that? The audience were able to get their message across. Do you think they were heard? Do you think, yeah. there'll, be, do you think there'll be develop, serious developments going forward? I think there might just be this time. I, I, I think I've never been in a room where, 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 where industry gatekeepers have confronted that level of, of you know, it's, it's a fairly united voice. You know, I'm sure if we went around the room, there's lots of us would disagree on different things and like that. But there we were, people of colour, disabled people, LGBT people. You know white Caucasian people of all classes saying look you know now's the time to be more diverse and we're kind of all saying that and I, I, I think yeah I think it might just have got across this time and, and to see two people from the one from the BBC one from the ITV saying actually yes I would be happy with the idea of quotas was extraordinary but if you look across that whole bench all the you know the, the, the people that were there today you had maybe one black and then you had one Asian yeah. or Indian, but, but then other than that, you talk about the head of BBC or talking about top of BBC, yeah. the top of ITV, yeah. and what do you see? Well, no, that, that, that's a big problem. And I'm looking at it, I'm thinking, yeah. right, so, okay, there's nobody there that looks like me. No. So, so there's that thing there, so how can I listen to you and trust what you're saying, because, <laughs> you, you know, it's like, well, why do you care how you I see, feel? That, that, I, you, know I, you know, no, I, I agree, and I think that's one of the big problems. You see, we, as, as minority ethnic yes. people, I, th I think we're very, very aware of that. You know, yeah. I, I watch, I, remember, I, I saw Hugh Quashy here. Who's yes, a, I interviewed you know, him earlier. Yeah, and, and, and I remember, I, I told him this, I went to Stratford Avon when I was like 19, I was a drama student, I watched yep. um, the Macbeth. Right. Sorry, Jonathan Price. He was playing Banquo. There was one other black guy who was his understudy. Right. And I was going, wow, there's black people in this. Because I, you, you know, whereas you, I think your average kind of powerful middle class person would see two black people in a play and go, wow, there's loads of black people. This is very diverse. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So they, you know, what's good is that they're there and they're fronting up. And maybe in a few years there'll be people like us there in their position. Absolutely. Thank okay. you so much. Oh, thank you. Thank you for talking to Baylor no, no, no. TV. Yeah. This is Baylor TV. We're out. Thanks.